a dream come true for me would be a little strong, but for me to watch a former player have this kind of moment, it's really tough to put that into words. That man is Stu Fritz, head coach of the Hope College baseball team, and that moment he's referring to will come tonight when his former player and current friend calls balls and strikes in game one of the World Series. DJ Rayburn, he played baseball at Hope College in the late 90s. After graduating, he took a leap of faith, and it has landed him behind home plate at the Fall Classic. Do you think you'll be cheering more for one of the teams or for DJ? No, I'll be as nervous as I am when I coach one of my own games. Not often do you hear about people with a rooting interest in the umpires at a baseball game, but that's where Stu Fritz will put his focus. DJ rings him up. Before DJ Rayburn was sending batters back to their dugout in the big leagues, he was playing center field for Fritz at Hope College. He and actually a group of four of his teammates from DeWitt were part of my first class, and we won three conference championships with him in the program. DJ graduated from Hope College in 1999, once a student of the school but always a student of the game. You know, he had a conversation with his, with his college roommate when he was a sophomore in college and uh, said that'd be really cool to do this. He might tell you that he really didn't know what else he wanted to do, and that's why he took that path. 3-2 coming, and Schwarber takes strike three call. A long and difficult path, but one that's led him to baseball's biggest stage. And DJ is no stranger to the big moment. I believe that he was on the field for Derek Jeter's last game. Last year, he had home plate for the wild card series with the Cardinals, so my wife and I were at that game. He's also no stranger to the managers of both these two teams, giving Arizona Diamondback skipper Tori Lovello his first career ejection in 2017 and tossing Texas Rangers Bruce Bochy earlier this season. Back in New York and watching that replay now, Bochy's going to get ejected. He's not big in stature and he's huge in heart. Fritz and DJ have stayed friends all these years later, and he'll be in the stands at Globe Life Field on Friday. There won't be a dry eye in the stands around us, I don't think, when the first pitch is thrown. That moment certainly comes with a lot of pressure. How do you plan on handling the, the heckling that's going to come around from, from the people nearby you? Oh, I'd love to tell you that I'll just let it roll off my back, but I'm, I'm sometimes not that good at that. But pressure is a privilege, and Fritz says DJ has earned it. He's a very committed person to really everything in his life, to his family, to his faith, to his profession. So it doesn't surprise me. He's waited his turn, and tonight's the night. It sure is, and if you're still deciding who to root for, then maybe you can just hope for a well-called game thanks to this West Michigan connection. First pitch for Diamondbacks versus Rangers is set for 8.03 p.m. tonight right here on Fox 17. I can tell you, I know one person who's hoping that maybe he's going to skew his calls in a certain direction. I'll be watching very closely, rooting for the Rangers. Yeah, as will the rest of the world. The rest it's of a the lot world. Of, it is a lot of pride. Can't stress it enough how much pressure I feel like of all under. the officiating in the Major League Sports, uh, baseball have to be the hardest. Being what? an ump is the hardest. Is there any reasoning behind that? I just feel like calling the pressure to call balls and strikes, calling somebody out or safe at first base. They've probably been under the most scrutiny of yeah. any sport as well. A lot of people calling for them to just get out of the game and have right. everything done electronically. But I don't know. We'll see what happens tonight. Right. We got a Rangers fan over here. Yeah. That's why hey, I said somebody that. Somebody else to root for now. <laughs> exactly. All right.